Okay, let's quickly run inside and see what we've done. Brilliant. Da da. Whew. Welcome on my friends, hope you're good. How are we today my friends? Hope you're keeping well. Before we kick off, make sure you drop a like this video. Uh, subscribe down below. If you're into all types of van um, conversions, that sort of thing, um, we are a family of four and we plan to go and do fully off-grid in our converted 2019, I say converted, we're on route. Fully converted 2019 uh, VW Crafter, long wheelbase van. So today my friends, it's 240 hookup time. So here we are, and we did buy another one. Here's the other one. There it was. This was the black version we were going to have as our 240 hookup for the van. Um, but the guy who brought it off was like, be careful about the cap. Don't fit it until you've actually fitted it into the van. So what we did was put this somewhere and then we lost the cap. So that's um, nice. So never mind. We went and brought this white one instead because our van's white. We went and brought the white one. So move over the black one. And uh, yeah, man. So uh, here we are. Bog standardy 240 hookup. That's pretty much it. You get the front, you get this little type of, uh, it's like a rubberized flange. <laughs> okay, haha, <laughs> jokes aside my friends. It's pretty cool because you get like a pre-made template there. So I'm just gonna uh, mark on the inside of there with a pencil, go through the corner with a drill bit, jigsaw all the way around, and then slot this bad boy in my friends. Things to note before we kick off, obviously we've got to go through everything. We don't want to cut a massive hole in the van and then be left with a big hole and then something doesn't work. So we've got some sicker flex, we've got some masking tape and we're going to tape uh, around the hole and then drill through that. We have said drill with a drill bit. That's a metal one, that's cool. We have an inverter which is ice. Love this because there's no other way of us getting power up to the van at all. So. Well, we're in like nowhere really. So we've got no power at the van. So we've got a battery. We've got two of these at home. We're gonna have three uh, in total. So two batteries, one 3000 watt inverter. And then of course, before we go making any holes in the van, check to see if it all works. We have a jigsaw with a metal bit in and a pink pen. Cause you know, why not? Before we get cracking, I've just been outside and just offered this up. We want to obviously go inside that hole, that cavity or that one. And the best place, honestly, is the middle of the panel, which is behind that like support thing. So we don't want to do that. So we're going to have it, I think, uh, other way, but just slightly off there-ish. Because there's these two uh, holes at the bottom, which obviously the power needs to connect to, uh, to our um, consumer board. So yeah, it needs to go back there. Uh, but it's always dodgy, you know, you're cutting holes in the van. It was the same with roof lights, windows. I figure out that this little pink spot here is pretty much going to be the middle. It will take a little bit, but and I'm going to use the centre of my window to line up with that. Okay, so I'm doing pretty much the centre of the window up there. Pretty much. Okay, and then if we go inside. And then look at the center of the window here. If we go down, it's gonna be in this gap here, that hole. Move back, there, it's gonna be inside that gap. Okay, so if we look at the center of the window here, it's gonna be inside that hole somewhere, which is ice. That's gonna be really good. Okay, so we'll go with that, my friends. We'll draw from the outside in one pilot hole, uh, and then we'll mask it all up. Quickly run inside and see what we've done. Brilliant. Da da. Whew. Couldn't be better. Okay, let's get the rest finished. Problem is, is obviously being parked on a main road and we don't have a drive to do our van. Is that, um, yeah. Everyone's always watching. 
Uh, you should wear goggles, but you know. I already have glasses, so haha. Yeah, it's right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Now me and Emma get on bike out some fire. Love it to bits. But she's not here at the minute. And I guarantee that if Emma was with me right now, oh, I'd be sweating. Stood there with her arms crossed. Have you done that right? <laughs> Just winging it. <laughs> oh, so there's the inside. That perfect. That couldn't have been better where I want it really to be fair. So that's really good. A lump of metal finish with. Nice to add to the collection. Not really. But there we go. Okay. Let's stick it on. Turn this off. Save ourselves some power. Thank you, inverter. Happy years. What the hell? You can see, you can hear the fear in me then. You could hear. Okay, we've got uh, some 32 mil drywalls. These are the ones we're going to use. 32 two mil drywalls. I know there's different types you can use, but uh, I love a drywall screw. Will that look rubbish? Black and white? I don't think so. The roof's going to be black. The, uh, the tubing on the ladder's going to be black. The wheel's black. So that's okay, so it sits nice and flush as well. Some sickle flex around there. A little bit of sickle flex on the inside of this. Pop it all in, screw it in. Done. Three, four. Okay, so. And you used this yesterday, it should be all right. Oh shit. Bloody hell, that's the, that's the floor. That's the concrete. Oh, I'm gonna get told off for that. Oh no. It's okay, I didn't do it. Someone will walk that in their house in a bit and their wife will shout at them. A bloody van down the side of the road. We'll just go like around the edge. You know, we don't want to go mad with it, but at the same time, we can screw it, see, directly, which is fine. But, oopsie. But at the same time, we don't want to... Uh, Pro TT, that's going to probably come over the top of it now. There we go, we'll be right. Doesn't that look better? And a little blob. And a little blob. And a little blob. 
Let me get one go with it, really. Okay. Because they're sticky, to be fair, or sticky anyway, but uh, you want to screw it as well, you know? I ain't bothered about any that comes out over the edge. Holy crap. There's a dent in the van. Actually, it's level. Perfect. Because, you know, I don't know about you guys, but I get triggered. If something's like a millimetre off, it's just like triggering very... Finish it all off with a little bit of Sikaflex around the outside. Paper wipes. At the bottom I hear you cry. Well, you can't see, but there's some sticking out the bottom already. So we don't really need any on. Oh my days. Almost looks professional. have a brew now have a good one my friends make sure you like the video subscribe i'll see you in the next one man all right